welcome back. This is my Dalmatian mansion. Um, it's a little weird. You, the whole concept of it is a little weird, but I wanted to do something different and I was feeling a weird kind of mood. Um, this lot comes with fast internet. It is homey and convivial. I built it in March of 24. It's a $202,000 residential. 50 by 40 lot, four bedroom, two bath, and I use some decorative items from the backyard stuff and from the holiday celebration pack, which I got the, the holiday pack for free. Um, so I think that's why I downloaded it. And then, yeah, I occasionally will use one or two things from the back. Um, yes, this is a very large home. As you can see, this is ginormous. Again, I was just playing and I was trying to take up as much of the lot as I could. Um, and then here's the inside. As you can see, it's very empty. There's a lot of black and white dots like Dalmatians. Yeah. If you love Dalmatians, this one's for you. Hee <laughs> hee. Black and white throughout with the little red. Bare essentials inside so you can add your own touches. Very spacious layout and a flat roof will allow for easy reno expansion. If you use it, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. You can find it on the gallery under Mama One. Or you can try searching under Dalmatian Mansion. Let's go check it out, shall we? Honestly, I don't know what I was thinking when I was making this. I just wanted something that was different and unique and strange, which this definitely is a strange one um, you can see the layouts a little odd but I do kind of like the little patio area back here that I did with the separation from the house so that you have some bushes back here which I never use these bushes there's just too much color going on um, but anyway I thought it worked out pretty well um, it is quite empty but I think it looks okay the thought, the idea was there. I don't think I did a very good job of relaying that idea into the build itself, but I will leave that up to you to decide if I did a good job or not. In any case, uh, we are here on the porch. No ceiling paint, which is fine. Um, but you walk in and yeah, black and white dots all over the place. I think the layout's kind of cool. We got the rugs down here. Everything's black and white. Uh, let's go this way first. Here is the little living room. We're gonna come up a little so you can see a little better. Um, fireplace, TV, piano over there. Again, black and white dots. Everything looks so tiny because the walls are so high. Here's the office, black and white dots, tall ceilings, through the office, what do we have? The kitchen, bar, Ooh, this kind of came out pretty cool, I think. So there's the bar, you've got your wine rack all the way to the ceiling, you've got plenty of room behind the bar to play and do whatever. I probably, yes, what I would probably do here in the corner is add a countertop that matches. I do believe there is one. Um, there's the dining room. We've got lights everywhere, although it does seem kind of dark in here. There's your kitchen bar with lots of seating. A lot of cabinets. <laughs> there's the living room over there. And this is a window into the soul it's a window um and then we have the hallway here sure lockers in the hallway in a mansion why not right this is where you come in or your guests come in they can take their shoes off and throw all their stuff in the locker so that they don't clutter up your pretty empty house so we go th straight through from the front door through that entry hallway and you have over there and then over here, we're gonna walk down the hallway here and through this door we have 
a ginormous bathroom with a toddler potty and a little rubber ducky. Spots everywhere. We have another door. So that was next to the bathroom. We have, oh my gosh, another bathroom. Exact same thing, but backwards. I, I don't know. Don't ask because I really don't know. And this hallway must be all the bedrooms. So in here we have a very large kids room and a little science thingy. And then let's see, let's see. We'll stay, no, we're gonna go across the hall. That's a big old hallway. Master bedroom, it's not as long as it looks. I was in fish eye view, I guess. Anyway, that's that room. And then the next door, right next door, is another bedroom. Lots of dots. Lots of Dalmatians. And then this is the toddler room. I love that little playhouse. It's very modern. Oh, we've got a little bassinet. A race car. Yep. That's a lot of house. If I go down, will it make it faster? No. Dang it. I was hoping it would. I can't figure out why sometimes I can go faster and sometimes I can't. It's really weird. But anyway, we come out here to the back patio. Through this beautiful glass door. And I really like the way I did this back patio. I will say that. I'm a little embarrassed about the house itself. But... You've got your grill and your seating over there, and then if you just kind of want to sit over here, you can. You, there's plenty of room to add whatever you want. Um, let's go and... Oh, wait. Can we get out to this? Oh, no. That's just the roof. Okay. Never mind. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. If we kind of look downward, as you can see, you have... Plenty of room in each of the bedrooms. You could probably make two rooms out of each one of these bedrooms, to be fair. But that will be up to you if you download it and use it. Um, I do have the carpet to guide you through the house because it is a large house. Two giant bathrooms. You can do something different with this. There's room. I mean, there is plenty of room in here to expand the house without going up or out. You could just use the space that's here. But that's basically the house. Um, there's not a ton of landscaping. Usually when I do like mansions and stuff, or larger homes, fancier homes, or modern homes, I tend to keep the landscaping to a minimum. But I did put polka dots on this little wall out here. Oh, excuse me. And I couldn't attach that because it kept doing that. So, you might want to like grab a bush or something and cover it up, however you want to do that. Um, but if you do download this and use it, let me know how it works out for you. If you renovated this and did anything different with it on the interior, please, please, please let me know. I would absolutely love to check it out and see what you did with it. I might go back and renovate this at some point, but not right now. I'd rather see what you guys do. Um, but in any case, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, leave your comments, questions, suggestions down below, and until next time, y'all, have fun!